day they arrived. Sweet. Oh, I can't wait. Oh yeah, black rhino. Can't wait. Okay. Look at this. Black rhino. Nice. Oh, I can't wait. So today we're actually um, heading down to the shop and we are going to be getting our new tires and rims. So I'm really excited. I can't wait to see uh, the new rims on this truck. Uh, but then I don't want to get them dirty. That's not good. Uh, but yeah, so that's where we're heading right now. It just stopped raining, which is nice. And uh, my appointment's at 12. And I've got like 15 minutes to get there. And I'm about five minutes away. But yeah. So I'm actually really, really um, happy this is getting done. Um, I am gonna keep my old tires, sell them, uh, get a couple bucks for them. Uh, I'm not gonna get anything for the rubber on them because I, uh, the truck's got a lot of power, so when you step on it at a stop sign, it spins out. So uh, I have a heavy foot. I try to keep it within the speed limit. I have got a speeding ticket. Um, in a long time, but I just got one a couple months ago, so I'm careful. Um, I don't believe that speeding is necessary. Um, do I go a bit over? Yeah, but I, I don't go excessive over where it's extreme. Well, I'm excited. Um, I'm just pulling into North, uh, sorry, uh, North Shore Off-Road. And we are putting on the new rims for the truck. And I'm actually really excited about this. Um, I actually can't wait to get something new, shiny. Like, oh, my light's not working again. I don't know why. That's interesting. Huh. Um, I'll have to have those looked at. I, ever since I got the new headlights, I've seemed to have issues with them. And I'm not too sure why. Um, but that's not what I'm here for today because uh, that always seems to correct itself, but it drives me nuts But we're here for the new rims and tires that will be going on the truck and I'm excited uh, I can't wait to see how it all works and how it's gonna look. I mean these things are pretty um, Enough that I don't want to actually get them dirty, but I'm actually looking forward to having a, a tougher stance on the truck uh, because it'll be a bit wider a bit taller uh, with a nice rim that's not um, gaudy or anything like that. So it will go perfect with the truck. Just a little bit of chrome and all black. So I'm excited. Let's get in there and let's get her dressed up for the ball.
can definitely see the difference between the old and the new. Holy. Well, I've got the new wheels on the truck. I've got the new rims, the new wheels, and I am excited. Uh, she just feels so, so much better. Um, she sits about two inches higher now. So with the lift, which was two inches, with the tires, which is two inches, I'm sitting at a total of four inches. And, um, I know another YouTube channel, Sonia, the RV DJ, you're going to be happy with the four, even though the answer is three. Um, that's off topic though. But yeah, um, I just got a bit of running around to do, pick up Caden, and basically feel out how she feels on the road. Um, so far, she feels the same. Uh, I'm just sitting, aw, dead squirrel. Poor guy. Uh, it's, it just, she feels the same, but I just want to test her out, see how everything just kind of feels, if that makes sense. Um, just because it's new, and I want to make sure that uh, everything's working properly. Uh, there, there's no rubbing, because I am on a bigger tire. I want to make sure there's no rubbing on the, the uh, truck itself. Um, otherwise, there might be some alterations that need to be done. And I don't want to do that. That's why I didn't go any bigger. And this truck's got a lot of power. So especially in the wet, um, wet conditions, I spin out very easy and I can fishtail the back end. And I've been going down the road sideways and I can correct it. Um, but it's being careful you don't do that. Sometimes I'll just throw her in four wheel drive and that fixes that issue. Uh, but yeah. We are just uh, gonna do some running around, do a few errands. Uh, but oh, I just love, I love the look, I love the feel, and I'm happy. Uh, I needed new rubber, so it was time to get some rims as well. And it makes her, it makes, holy cow, that one's really wide. Um, but that truck's not made for off-roading. It, it just makes me feel happier. It makes me feel like I got a new vehicle, which is nice to have. So I'm happy I did what I did and it makes me feel like I've got a, a new truck again. So if you like what you see, 
if you like watching us, uh, whether you like me and Kate and Natasha, you can find out more information on our website. And that's www.vancityadventure.ca where we've got some actually pretty cool merch. This is one of our new ones. And there's a few others that are in the works. Um, I just did a um, adventure begins where the pavement ends. And that's actually something that's really cool because for us, that's what it is. Um, our adventure begins where the pavement ends, but not always. Sometimes we're on pavement. Pavement takes us there. So don't be restricted just by pavement. Uh, I'm just pulling into the P.O. box, but I want to thank everybody for tuning in and watching. And if you like what you see, like, subscribe, and join the fun. You can join our family as well by joining the Epic Squad in our membership section. So thank you, everybody. We really appreciate you. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you soon. See you in the next one, okay? Remember, do epic shit. Get out there.